What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John, for the game video here. Welcome in the yo! Back to another episode of the Saga Lock. Today, we are going to be getting to Winden, which is absolutely insane. How the heck are we even in this place already? Anyways, carrying forth. Um, I should give you a team recap because last episode was a encounters episode. And you all know with encounters episodes, things are going to go crazy. But um, I did this thing called a nah healing up, apparently. I mean, I guess I really can't. Um, but we have our boy, Bobby, who I didn't go ahead and edit. Um, so whoops on my part. We have Toxic Purify Energy Ball and Guav apple then we have a lovely yam with shell side arm heat wave sparkling aria and lands wrath we have katie girl with the assault vest um we're gonna get this off on katie girl with stone edge sacred fire guava apple play rough then we have daddy with friend guard baneful bulk power up punch flying press and drain punch then we have Fruition, Weak Armor, Spectre Thief, Shadow Ball, Rising Voltage, and Aura Sphere. And we have Whale About with Land's Wrath, Facetious Rend, Lava Plume, and Ancient Power. And that's the team. Wow, that was a really quick team recap. I didn't realize I went through that as fast as I did. But first things first, let's go to our other items category because we got some important things in the latter episodes. First off, we have this Assault Vest to give to Katie Girl, who apparently is damaged. I didn't realize that, so that's fun. Um, and then we have a... Oh, we've had Heavy Duty Boots for a while. Um, that might be a good addition to somebody. We don't have anything that's weak to that yet, so I'm not necessarily all too worried. Um, about that. Scope Lens we're going to give to Spoopy. And then the leftovers is going back on fruition. So yeah, let's get the show on the road. Um, obviously, Spoopy's moveset's going to be altered um, at a later time because I was silly and forgot to do it. And that is 100% my fault. So, we'll just have to deal with it later. Obviously, the only alteration to Spoopy's moveset was going to be Cross Poison anyways. So, I'm not all too worried. So, but yeah. Let's get the show started with this dude. Do you have an injured Pokemon? Because I'm a doctor. <laughs> I don't think you actually heal me. So, I'm not really worried about you, doctor. You have a Sogaleo. Cool. I have uh, a problem with that, actually. What level are you, though? You're like 47. Psychic Surge Sogaleo. Okay, I gotta swap out immediately, but... 47, probably? 45. Oh, we're fine. We are fine, doodles. I figured we were, but it just never hurts to double-check and make sure. Um, I don't really know who to go into, though, necessarily, on a Sogaleo, because Sogaleo is kind of one of those weird Pokemon. I'm gonna go with my gut, and my gut says to... Um, to uh, to drain punch. Yeah, I'm glad I did that. Okay, set up a sword stance and is faster than me. That's great. Um, that, this is not a good situation by any means. Hail's gonna help us out. Ha. Huh. A plus two psychic move is just the end of me. So I'm going to go into fruition. I think I have to go into fruition. Yes! Oh my gosh. Yes, I do actually have to go into fruition. Swords Dance again. Extra sensory. That's fine. That's that's resisted heavily. Yes. Oh my gosh. I mean, it doesn't necessarily matter. But we got an Oko on deck. Or a, what would be an Oko on deck. Um... Because of Spectre Thief. So that was a really good play on my part. Unintentionally so. But it was. So I'll take it. Because that's super effective. Plus two. It's dead. It, there's no way it's alive. Yeah. No way in heckles. We are chill. Okay. 
Katie girl, or no, yay yeah, gets to level up. Katie girl almost leveled up. And we defeated the doctor. And the doctor doesn't heal me, I don't think. I think I can, I'll try and talk to the doctor. But I don't think he heals. No. It's a mean doctor that doesn't heal you. There's a lot of healing opportunities in this game, though. So I'm not really all too concerned. Who are you? You, you, you are a trainer. I want to avoid you if I can. Coolio, I can manage to do that. My th thought process is to avoid most of the trainers in this blizzard situation, if I can. Uh, hi, Haxorus. You are in the way, buddy. Can I have you not be in the way? Oh my gosh. Comet Shard. There's so much attacking me! Anyways. I'd rather the Type Null than the Haxorus, because I can run away from the Hax or the Type Null. Whereas the Haxorus, I couldn't. Um, so... Yeah, the Haxorus is too fast for me to run away from in in the immediate. Oh! They actually did good. Fine. It's fine. I'm not triggered at all. Post Watch me get actually punished for trying to be uh, stealthy. Guzzlord, huh? Kind of helping get multiple mons. You do. Then I will take the power up punch to start. So that guarantees the Oko. And if he wants to heal. Oh, he roared. Dang it. Who we got? Who's getting sent out? Katie Girl. Oh, Katie Girl's just fine, actually. That I'm not gonna complain about that. That's uh in immediate fairy type play here. Because if it tries to go for dragon, it doesn't matter, and dark is resistant if it lives. But it won't. But in the case that it did. Yeah, that's perfect. And then now we see what it, what, uh, what he wants to send out next. Gonna assume steel. Golisopod. Trying to think if we have any better options for Golisopod. Uh, I don't think the answer is yes to that, so. I just have to be careful with how I choose to go about it. I'm going to go with Bug, or uh, Rock. And if we hit, we're totally fine. Ah, we didn't hit. Okay. We should still be okay. We're defensive. We should still be a fine. Bug bite. Oh, now you choose to go for a... Okay. I figured you'd go for water, but... I mean, if you, don't, you don't have to if you don't want to. I'm not going to tell you you got to do something, but... That kind of seems odd for you not to go for the water attack when you're going against a rock type now. But you know what? If you don't want to make sense, you don't have to make sense. If, I, if I'm sounding like I'm forcing it to make sense, then I'm not. Because honestly, that would be too rude of me to do. Well, I'll my hail. And we just kill it now. Sorry for the yawn. I've been yawning a lot today. And that's not a good thing. I don't like the fact that I'm yawning a lot. Um, I'm going to hit you with the 100% accurate move. Turn myself into a grass type. Uh-huh. Because, again, for some reason, you're attacking me with Bug Bite because you think Bug Bite's your best option. Again, don't mind that, but it's weird. It's very weird. And I don't necessarily know how to go about it, but I'm going about it in the way that I can think about going about it. So, I'm not like, it's not a bad thing. I lost. When I think about it, I didn't want it to ever end. Here's $4,000. Thank you for our follower store, buddy. Ah, no, Litten. Well, that's not Litten. That's, uh... What's his name? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> I, uh, this episode's been a lot of, what do I rather... What do I rather run away from? <laughs> that's been the bulk of today's episode. What do I rather run away from? And today, in that time, I hit the wrong move. That's not gonna die. Oh, my God, it is. <laughs> Bunnelby's bad. I knew that, but, like, also, I wanted to... Heal up on the Bunnelby. 
But hey, Daddy leveled up because I accidentally did something stupid. Um, so that's cool at least. Okay, that's a force to traitor. Hi guys. No, 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 no. Stop. I'm trying to evaluate the situation and I just can't. I'm not allowed to evaluate the situation. It's frustrating. Like, especially as somebody who likes to evaluate the situation, not being able to sucks. Uh, I want to evaluate, but I'm not allowed. Grr. No. Oh, okay. Ah. Uh, let's not do that. Healing and more healing and fruition. I'll heal you too because it's a force trainer battle and I'm scared of it. Per the huge. I just love how it's like, per the huge, I'm scared of something. What? John being scared of something? Oh my gosh. His The fact that I can't see him but he can see me is freaking ridiculous. Hi, Hiker Donald. Oh, look. It's a Diggersby. We have that covered. We figured out that Diggersby is bad against Daddy, so. Dottie is going to take care of it with a drain punch this time if I click the right move. Sleep talk. You're not a sleep bu buddy. That's not how sleep talk works, but you know what? I'll, I'll take you throwing. Throwing is not a bad thing for me. Although I just healed daddy up, so that was a pointless heal, but how was I supposed to know? Bear tick. Oh, nice. Daddy takes care of that too. Two things daddy takes care of very well. Bye, bear tick. And we're full healed. Or it's full health. Ba -da 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 -da. That way I did not. Okay. <laughs> uh, whale about level 52. What is whale about going to get? No moves. I think whale about's done learning moves. Which, to be perfectly honest, kind of makes sense. So I wouldn't be too mad about it. All these massive snowflakes. Yeah, I can't even avoid these battles, which is like, uh. Also, y'all know that that double battle up there is literally just a copy of Sword and Shield, and I hate it. Or, uh. Hi, Shiny. I haven't seen you a uh, Shiny in a while. Um. Shiny Surf Etched. I'm gonna go into Spoopy Spoopersons. Or, yay. I think Spoopy Spoopersons makes more sense. Yeah, Spo I'm gonna go Spoopy Spoopersons. That makes a lot more sense. If it meteor assaults. Ah! There's the audio I was talking about. If it meteor assaults. I don't like that, but I'll deal with it. Guava Apple, I guess. Not like we could have used the Cross Poison on it, but... Okay, it dies next turn. So... Um... 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 No, 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 no. Free Omni Boost. Free Omni Boost! I've got to go for it. And hope to kill. Yeah. Doom Desire cannot pop off. Doom Desire is not allowed to pop off. Please. It also did stupid, so we should be okay regardless. Thank goodness. Oh, wait. Is this a multiple? This has to have multiple battle, have multiple mons to it. Doom Desire is going to pop off. Ugh. Buffeted by hail. The Doom Desire attack hits. Volcanion, of course. Why would it be anything else? Um, I've got to trust in Whale About. It's going to use water attacks if I send out Whale About. Do I find that? No. It's a man, so hopefully it attacks me and hits me. And a cute charm saves me because whale about be a cute boy. But Oh, you got three mons. We're not even close. Okay, Land's Wrath. 
Mind Reader. Volcanion took aim at Whale about. That doesn't matter, though. Oh, Whale about. Look at. Oh my gosh, let's hand. Whale about! Yes, buddy! Yes! Uh, you O code it with the. It's ability! Whale about! I love you, buddy. You came in clutch there. Thank you. And now the sand's up, and a whale lord's coming in, which is easy claps for Spoopy. Thank you. Yeah, that's easy. I, I, I agree. That's easy claps for Spoopy. Let's go, buddy. I love you. When you that was a very good. It could have been easy claps for uh, Daddy, too, actually. Now that I, th I think about it, too. Whale Lord's got that HP. He do be thick. He's going to live one. But... He's not living more than one. Hydro Cannon. Oh, we live that. We live that. We're fine. We're fine. We're chill. Did some damage, but it's okay. Sandstorm hurts us. I'm not all too worried about that, though. It's... I almost freaked out. I saw speed boost and went, oh, God. No, it doesn't matter. Because there's this lovely thing called... Uh, rest turns. It would have been faster, though. So I had the right to, like, think in my mind, oh, no, there's a problem. But take a little extra time to think, and you avoid freaking out. And you beat Gentleman Glenn with his stupid Pokemon. Oh my gosh, you were so marvelous. Oh, were we now? It's also continuing to use our hyper pushes, which is totally fine. So, yeah, we got to make sure before the semifinal thing, we do. Uh, we are we are forced to take them on. Okay, double vital time. It's been a while. I'm glad we could meet up again. Let's see how strong you've gotten. Great Pokemon traders really shine with something special when they're on camera. Oh, boy. Okay, what do you guys got? You have a Poltergeist and a Roserade. How do I go about this? Daddy's really not the best option. But they got two Pokemon each, so I'm going to play setup game and try and mark the Roserade if I can. Ah, the Roser, the one Pokemon I wanted to hit, it missed. Strength Zap's fine. It's healing, which is ridiculous, but it's okay. Moongeist Beam, that's going to hurt whoever it attacks. It attacked the yay and did almost half. Ah. Okay. It didn't attack into daddy, though. Hail's impacting everybody. Oh, that's telling you who's fat, what the speed is. Okay. I kind of want to keep yay out. The bigger threat here... Is absolutely the poltergeist. But again, we can't really attack it very well. I guess I'm going to attack it physically. Uh, but the problem is, if the Roserade actually, actually attacks into me, then I've got a problem. I'm going to use Daddy to heal. And then I'm going to Land's Wrath. Because that should hurt the Poltergeist a lot more than it did. Or than the other one did. Plus it puts the Roserade in range. Roserade shouldn't die, but the Roserade will be in range. Ah, I'm glad I did what I did. Oh 
my gosh. Uh, that could have been so bad. That would have been horrific. That would have been the death of Ye. I am so happy that I did what I did. That would have been the death of Ye right there. And I would have been pissed off to no end if Ye would have died that way. I would have been livid if Ye died that way. Thank gosh Ye did not. But still, holy pajibus. Okay, well, I'm going to get the Roserade out of the way with that. And then I'm going to heal Ye with a Max Potion. Because Ye got crit with the Crab Hammer. So, that crit did something. A double, cr a double crit would kill, but that's really low chances. It's really low. It's a four on a four, so... Uh, and what I mean by 4 on a 4 is it's 1 in 25 squared, which is 1 in 500, which, yeah, very minimal. Literally 0.05%. Or, no. Because point five or 0.5%, point 0.1%. It'd be 0.1 percent because 0 0.5, 0 0.33, 0 0.25, 0 0.2, 0 0.2, 0 0.2 percent. So there would be a 99.8 percent chance of survival. Caracosta, that is something I can deal with just fine. Not something Yay particularly likes to deal with yet again, but. And actually, to the point that I'm going to switch out, yay. I love you, girl, but no. I just not... I don't need you to deal with a, a, a freaking water attack from a water type going into your face. Especially if Moon Guys Beam actually lands into yay's slot, then I save yay's life again. I, I sh saved a lot yay in a surefire manner rather than a, I don't know if it's faster or not manner. Daddy wants to learn low sweep. Hmm. I kind of like that over flying press. I do like that over flying press actually. Yeah. I don't need Flying Press. I have a draining move. And if I need to slow things down, I can now. Although this Poltergeist is getting annoying. It's getting on my nerve. Especially considering I cannot physically hit it. Or I, rather, I should say Daddy cannot physically hit it. Just in case it tries to target into me. I almost want to be a cheeky. Is it worth it being cheeky though? Six plus six. That's 18%. No, it's not. Not worth being cheeky. Still did not die. What the heck? But yes, I that was perfect. Okay, Daddy should be able to take out whatever comes out next. At plus two, Car Cramorant. I hate to say it, but what are you? I genuinely do not know. I want to say, and my brain says that you're water and flying. At least that's what my brain's telling me. I know for sure it's water. 
because I believe this is the th this is the thing that like when you use serve, it can get like either the um a Pikachu in its mouth or something else in its mouth, and it, depending on what it has in its mouth, something bad happens. It's either chip uh, extra like twelve percent chip or paralyzation. I want to say, but is it flying? I guess we're gonna find out. Oh no 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 no! Ah uh, ah uh, uh. Wrong move. I'm gonna go off of the basis that it's a part flying type. Because again, that is what my brain is telling me, and I think it's best for me to listen here. It is. Oh, I don't have experience with that Pokemon. That I did not like that feeling. <laughs> I genuinely did not like that feeling at all. But it is what it is. That I'm, I gotta get used to that feeling because Gen Nine's coming right up, and I don't know any of the freaking Pokemon at all. Like, like I or I shouldn't say any because that's a lie. I know some of them, but like not all of them at all. Nor what they do, what their types are. X Y Z A B. None of the abilities and what they do except for Toxic Debris, which is because I play Hazards a lot, so that's the only reason that I know that ability because it was like, oh, a Pokemon that says Hazards, Goth Queen. Like, that's literally all I know. And then the Terra Typing situation, which I only know because obviously I'd have to know that. Um, I don't know. I mean, we're literally not doing it in our Gen 9 Nuzlocke, so that's not going to be allowed. But I know it, ex it exists, at least. So that way I'm not like, oh my god, how did you actually turn into a different typing? Ah! It's like... And I'm sure the game explains it, and I'll probably get Hot Shady Penguin to explain it. But, besides, the point is, I know minimal about Gen 9. Got to get used to and comfortable with the feeling of, what the heck is that? And what does that do for me? And how does this work? And y'all got to get used to those questions, too. <laughs> because you're going to get have to get prepared to listen to them. Which I, unfortunately have to say I'm sorry about because yeah that's unfortunate that you guys have to listen to that make your way to win in look at that we are here we're running Winden building all those shaders The music! Ah, uh, yes! Uh, turn that thing up! Alright, Winden City, here we are! This is the place where I finally get to become a legend at last! You get it, don't you, mate? I'm gonna destroy you in the new and be the new champion of the Galar region! You hear me? That is it! I am headed to Winden Stadium right now! Don't waste too much time. You should be heading there yourself. Girl, we have so much to do. Um, we gotta pre prepare to slap the crap out of you. So we gotta go to this Pokemon Center right here. Because I need to go ahead and fix Spoopy a little bit because I oops didn't fix Spoopy. And and not that it didn't not that it costed me, but I would like to have poison stab on my poison Pokemon. And we literally have Cross Poison, so let's use it. And the other thing I got to think of it about is Toxic, and if I actually want to have Toxic. Like, if Toxic actually helps with stuff. I mean, I have technically the ability to Poison Stall. Already? Wait, Waterfall's just here? Okay. Honestly? I'm fine. 
That's only one fourth. And that's more of a double battles move, so. I think Toxic's okay. I can't get crit with this Pokemon. Unless something decides to scale swap. So I don't have that to worry about. And yeah. So we're going to go talk to Hal. I don't think that triggers the uh, the thing yet. I think he just goes, we can do this now. And then in the next episode, in 280, y'all will see the semifinals. How that plays out. And how you want to destroy the team before the finals. So I think that's a really cool concept for you guys. And a really big positive. Just being able to see how this team interacts with the six the six three six battles to come. So This is the reception desk. Turns out it was the first to register for the champion cup. In other words, I'm already number one. It's pretty much in the bag that I'm gonna win this thing, okay? John, correct? We've been watching your performance on the gym challenge. This is just a formality, of course, but we need to check your gym badges if you don't mind. I'm all sorted and ready to battle you on the biggest stage of them all. But it looks like Bede couldn't make it. Hard luck! Somehow I didn't think he'd take being disqualified laying down. <laughs> you know what I mean. Like, gosh, I cannot believe he did that. Like, wow. Hop, you're really sounding a lot like Bede right now, and I don't like it. I guess it is what it is then. Ha! <laughs> Come on, we should head to the locker room now. No. Attention, gym challengers who have made it through the gym challenge. The semifinals will be starting soon. Please head to the stadium and pitch in when you are ready. No. Can we leave? I want to leave. Can I leave? I didn't mean to get stuck here. Oh, I can leave. Cool. So, in the next episode of the Pokemon Saga Lock, we will be going ahead and doing the semifinals. I cannot believe that we are here already on the big stage. Um, we got to fight some. We got to fight with Hop. We got to fight with Marty and a fight with Bede. Back to back to back. It is going to be something spectacular. And you guys do not want to miss it. Especially because you will be murdering one of the teams, one of the teammates down below. You guys get to decide who the heck it is. I'm scared. But you only have like less than 20 hours to do it so you gotta make your decision quick snappy because you know it has to unfortunately be that way my bad i'm sorry it was my fault that it is that way because i you know i missed one episode and it's missing an episode really sets this series in a weird way so again i apologize it is my fault but yes friday to, or you have until well really the end of the day today to do that so this is gonna go up a little early to compensate but yeah i love you guys so very much and i will see you guys on 280. Oh, not this episode. The next episode. Anyways, besides the point. Love you all. Mwah.